Today we're here to talk and show you the new Bubba 250, the MC250 RTB. This is a traditional old school bobber. We want to uh, show you some of the features of it. Uh, first off, we got a uh, full size motorcycle here. This isn't a three quarter size or half size. This is a full size motorcycle. Uh, we have 21 inch front wheel. This uses a tubeless spoke wheel, uh, which is a um, very nice thing to have. You don't have to worry about inner tubes or leaks or replacing that. Also gives the uh, motorcycle a better balance. <clears throat> uh, you have nice thick steel spokes here, powder coated black rim. Uh, we have CST tires. This uses a 21 inch front wheel. It's a uh, 909021 front disc brake with a two piston caliper. We also have steel braided lines uh, that come standard on this model. Uh, usually you find these motorcycles to have rubber lines. These have steel braided. Uh, we've got the black fork legs here. You can see we've got a lot of travel here in the fork. Uh, we've got fork gaiters here to protect against any stone chips on the forks. We've got nice thick 41 millimeter fork tubes. We have DOT approved lighting all the way around on this from the turn signals, the side markers, the headlight, your instrumentation, rear tail light and turn signals as well. Over here we have our controls. Here you have your kill switch, your on off, your uh, starter button here as well. You got a nice large uh, master cylinder that holds a lot of brake fluid. Over here you got hazard switch, your high low, turn signals and horn. On your instrumentation, we have a speedometer that's in miles per hour, a neutral indicator, a high beam indicator, turn signal indicator, odometer, and trip. The ignition switch is located here on the side, just kind of like the old school bobber look. And if we look down here, this is where your steering lock is, and it uses the same key as your ignition to lock the steering. So when you park your bike, you could be sure it's going to be safe. The frame is all tube, mandrel bent, it's MIG welded. The gas tank uses an old school style peanut tank with a locking gas cap. The gas cap is actually stainless. Down on the motor here, this is a uh, 250 motor. Um, we have a, a five speed manual transmission in it. The carburetor here uh, is actually kind of a nice piece. Uh, we got an accelerator pump on here which gives you a lot more bottom end power when you take off. And it's also got a, a high volume air filter, lets it breathe a little bit better. On the other end of the motor, we got the exhaust coming out. And this is a nice deep toned uh, baffleless slash cut pipe, gives it a nice rumble. And the foot pegs here, you can see, are really nice. These are knurled uh, pegs here, which will give you a good grip on your feet. And these are also steel and they're MIG welded, so they're not going to break anytime soon. In this compartment here, we have all the electronics. Uh, your CDI is in there. And down in here, we have the battery box. And it just gives it a clean, clutter-free kind of look. <clears throat> the spring here, it's also an old school style 50 seat. That's actually spring loaded. Um, so the back end's rigid, but you have a suspension here in the seat to absorb uh, any road imperfections. The fenders on this bike are also bobbed, uh, hence the bobber name. Uh, they're trimmed back and it has a nice little racing stripe that starts from the back, goes to the gas tank and onto the front fender. And looking at the back here, we have our DOT approved turn signals here again. And on the back, we have a 18 inch uh, rear wheel. This also has a CST tire. It's a 140-70-18. Again, with the tubeless spoke wheels on it. It's got a very large rear disc brake again with a two piston caliper on it. There's a rigid, um, uses a 520 chain and sprockets, which are available at any local motorcycle shop. Makes it easy to replace and maintain. Uh, the engine really is uh, one of the best engines that you could get out of China. Uh, it's from a company called uh, Zongshen. And it's a uh, 250, it's a uh, push rod motor. Well, thanks for watching our video. We hope you enjoy our new Bobber 250. If you have any questions, feel free to shoot us an email. 
Thank you very much and have a great day.